So last night, Rain decided she wanted to stay out all night, hang out with the outside dogs, and that was good. And today, when I come out and feed the calf, it's uh, lots of fun and playing, and she seems to be settling in real nice. So now we'll see if we can get her to kind of stay down with the sheep and guard them. And ooh. Oh, yeah. Oh, Stubbs, take it easy on her. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, there's a good dogs. I would just like to reiterate that uh, the little black, white, and red one here is blind. Like, and not, can't see very well, but like doesn't have eyeballs and her eyes are sewn shut. So she gets around so well. So it's a beautiful frosty morning. Everything is just covered in frost. It's only about minus 15, but uh, yeah, it's a, it's a nice minus 15. No wind, just sort of a, a pleasant morning. But uh, yeah, I gotta go to work, so I haven't got time to just hang out. So I'll talk to you guys later. It's Friday, March 4th. It's a, a beautiful sunny day. It was cold last, well cold for this time of year, it was minus 10. And, uh, but today I think we're already above zero. And just a little update on how the sheep are doing. They're all digging into their bales really well. It's a, it's a good day to kind of just, just be a sheep, I think, you know? Like, are you happy to be a sheep? Yeah, that's right. So, and you can kind of see here how the feeders work. So they've been eating. Stubby, no, none of that. So they eat at the outer layers and then the outer layers collapse and we'll be left with a core and then that core will uh will also collapse once uh once the outer layers get eaten down a bit more um it's not 100 percent foolproof i sometimes have to come out and wiggle things around and make things happen the way i want them to but uh but yeah for the price of a couple of panels you really can't lose Now this is Daisy today. She's standing dead on straight to me. You can see how wide she is. She's very pregnant. We expect that she will have her calf sometime in the next couple of weeks here. You can see her udder is getting, uh, it's not tight tight, but it's firming up. So we'll uh, pop her do. Now, leave Daisy alone. We expect that she'll have her calf in the next few weeks and then we're back to milking. Exciting times for everyone. Here's a little update on Rain. She was our former house dog that we're trying to turn into a sheep dog and actually she's coming along surprisingly well. I see her often sitting just on the edge of the group of sheep. And she didn't even follow. I just took a walk out in the field and uh, two of the dogs came with me, but she wasn't one of them. She just stuck here and now it kind of helps that there's a nice sun to bask in and, and all that. But still, more than once I've seen her just, just hanging with the sheep. And she doesn't scare them. She doesn't generally do quick movements. She's just a calm, steady moving animal. Doesn't spook the sheep. Doesn't freak them out. Ah, she might be working out. We'll see.